ABC works. And then we're going to have to create another variable as I use RE right here. The value of RE is negative B over 2A. Make sure your parentheses are correct, guys. And right here, we're going to put a bunch of if statements to see if uh, d is equal to zero, greater than zero, or less than zero. Then less than zero, and then here is greater than zero. Now we're going to do, now we're going to implement the methods, e0, and then again for less than zero, and then for greater than zero. And that should be it. Okay, so save both of these. Let's run this. So, value for A, reduce to one. Value for B, four. Value for C, four. And there we go. That's basically saying x squared plus 4x plus 4, which will leave x plus 2 uh, whole squared, which will then give you the root of negative 2. If you have any questions, leave them in the comment section below. Thanks for watching.